All right, now we're back. Um, I don't even know. You know this guy might say what's up. I want to drive these things. Okay. Where does the coconut from, dude? Let's see, I put your stuff in high over here. Okay, window. Yeah. Got some shit in here, it tasted coconut. Let's go in ice cream, huh? Maybe I can get something with that ice cube. That didn't help at all. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, of course. Not <laughs> probably because, but I ask why. See if there's anything cooked, we're gonna flavor on it. I never suck with ice cream, so you look. I'm doing this for nothing, rats. I should stop doing that. But like, I've been everywhere, man. Is there something in here? It's like, hey, I just know, but I'm curious how someone's something mine would do. It's a mine. Never mind. I'll see if you're better than Eugene. The illustration, hey man, there. Whoops, in the hole. This is your first try. Better luck next time. Bjorn, what's up? It's trying to listen to the phone. Oh, shit, right? You can't, right? Do you have anything important to do? Probably. We'll get to it. Okay. What a dick. Okay. What business is though? I should call back later. Okay. He's gonna phone Buddy Guy again? I don't know if I have information, but I don't have anything else to say. Okay. You got a cookie, I guess? I'm gonna ask you, Mom, I could do something with that ice cube. No. I don't. Uh, 
I don't. I'm really stuck, dude. I don't, <laughs> I'm fucking no fucking clue. No fucking clue. Torn paper. Crunch, crunch. Not bad. It's kind of sweet. No wonder drip. Someone else must be eating the wrong. Okay. The fuck. What the fuck, man? I'm actually fucking like. Okay, exit waste basket sticker. Put a sticker here. No ads, please. Did you mistake for a mailbox movie? Golf club. Licks. Unfortunately, go with this like strawberry. Why is he on both this? Like, why is this on both this? I don't get it. That's gross. It doesn't have any flavor. Nope, not a flavor. I only wouldn't think. Okay. Yeah, that's right, Urban Legend. I'm gonna prove it. Ah, I'm dead. Game over. <laughs> Fuck, man. I thought I'd try it. Okay. Well, I've never heard of that deal. So, hey, Snow White, what's that pig doing? Hey, Stella, don't you hear her screaming? And I later, wow. That's what I call a modernized remake. That was... That's good. Okay. I don't know what to do... I don't. I'm like, is there like anything else I can do? Got my mess hall. Yeah, I don't. I guess I'm stuck. So I don't fucking know, dude. <laughs> this is fucking stupid. You got fucking coconut or what? No. No.
Okay. Hmm. <laughs> well, it's gotta be in here, right? Like, you think. I don't... <laughs> Fuck, man. Flash it yourself. I don't No, I don't actually I actually have no f fucking idea. Okay. I don't I don't know what to do, man. I'm fucking lost and this fucking cookies don't do shit. I don't resume game. Well, that's me for this part. Just like and subscribe and peace.
Okay. All right, we're back. Yeah, I figured out do read this read some read a walkthrough because I wouldn't have figured it out otherwise. Oh, what the fuck! Put any scissors in here. I can take. No, I need something good. Scissors. I'm gonna cut a hole in my pants. Here's all this color flavored deodorant. Yeah, this is it. Coconut. Yeah, that's it. So maybe a little more here. We're over the ice cube. You want me to know it's all it's all in mine. Alrighty, let's do this. Almost cooking ice cream. Moss, can I have it? Give me a click. I think it's just a minute. First, I like to talk to inspect the case. And here, can I can give you a point for tomorrow if you really want. Really? If I really want? These are the things I searched tight and love for that blood ice cream. It was fun. Alright, so your appointment with the inspector is at 10 a.m. tomorrow morning here at the first floor. Does that suit you? Farewell. Here, take this. You earned it. Now, I must run here and buy. Next, mmm, delicious. Mmm, there's a weird aftertaste. I should quit smoking and losing my sense of taste. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, man. Alright, that's so that's already sunset. Let's call a day and go to Tom's. You should be home now. Tom's apartment. Well. Ah, there you are. I'm starting to worry. So how's your fishing? Catch anything? Nothing. Not an unfavorable wind. I'll try again tomorrow. You seem all weird in the college this morning. I didn't know anyway, but even worse than usual. What happens if you're knocked out? No, you knocked out what happened. I was getting I was getting to it. Last night when I came home, I went straight to bed. You don't say after all that I'll call you a drink? Don't answer me, please. I was sleeping soundly when suddenly I heard a noise. It seemed like someone was in the living room. Thinking it, this might be a thief, I took a flashlight. Oh, how brave. Hey. What are you going to do in this situation, huh? Anyway, I started searching when he suddenly knocked me from behind. Next thing called police, that'd be so much smarter. Yeah, but waiting for the police to arrive, the thief would have had time to rob the entire apartment. Anyway, woke up the morning after your phone call. You get it now? Why well, couldn't just go fishing with you? Yeah, but if it didn't, well, you probably stood out on the floor. I made a phone call, but I just remember something. Before it happened, I got an honest phone call. Something was like, what were you in danger? Hit seriously? That was nonsense, so I hopped on him. Who was he? Hey, Grisha, anyway. Someone else who knew it was gonna happen. Drinks. Yeah. August, oh, disgusting. Never mind that. So, after waking up, did you go to the police station? Yep, the guy this couldn't kill us about my case. With numerous attempts, I managed to convince him to get me an appointment with the inspector. No, not that guy again. You know him? Or not exactly, but I've been told about him. He's totally unpleasant. Well, I talked to my neighbor. She told me after a fight last night, I found a thief. She said, What was your name? How does this relevant to the situation? I wish like physically. Stop that. You get your rot breath off of me. Alright, alright. Jeez, go on. She gave me a lighter that belonged to someone named Hector. Probably my attacker. What? He must have lost it in front of the apartment. Why are you surprised? Just what kind of thief would do something so foolish? Yeah. We, uh, I went to the mining company, which is what written in the lighter. The government let me into the archives room, so you called me to create you got you called me to create a diversion. Yes, clever, eh? I get this address. I think I told you everything. But no, wait. I forgot to tell you about the... You know what? It's getting late. How about you tell me in the morning? Since when do you care about the time? I've got a few things to finish. Never mind you. Never actually told me about your job. Oh yeah, I'll tell you another day. I'll be fishing at the lake tomorrow. This time I'll help you catch some... See me. Sure problem. See you then. Have a good night. Hope your attacker doesn't come back. Thanks, man. Works hard today. I'm exhausted. That was a time. I've been home before it's dark. Hey, Eugene, did you scare all this crash? I wonder what kind of idiot would do that. Oh, well, no point cleaning up the clean lady comes once a week. They should be here any minute now. Anyway, bye, Eugene. I don't want to waste my time talking to you. Okay. That was weird. 
That was a weird. Chapter 2. Fun and fair. Yawn. That was a night. That was a good night. Man, it's already late. I need my appointment with the inspector. After that, I'll check on Hector. Hector's house. Then I can do some fishing with Tom by the lake. Cool. Oh, man, I almost forgot the fun business today. So excited. Well, now I'm gonna end it. This episode. <laughs> Next, I just took, I meant to pause it and then to say it. But now that's the end of this episode, this part. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace.